Hey, I'm Matt with Generag. Today we're going to go through setting up a Pro 1200 with a Raven RCM through the task controller. So join me as we go through setting up the 1200. All right, so to begin with, we'll need to set up our implement. So we'll hit the settings tab on the top. We'll click on implement over on the right. And we'll click on edit. And we'll make an implement name. We can leave it on NH3 tool. Next, we will switch it from spreading to application tillage since we have an anhydrous bar on the back of the tractor. Next, we will select our implement type and we'll select NH3 applicator. Implement make, case IH, implement model. You can just add whatever model you'd like. We'll make this a 940 and we'll hit apply and then we'll hit save and then you'll see the picture on the right switch from the new leader bed to a application tillage equipment so then next over on the right to continue setting up our implement we'll hit measurement and you'll want to make sure that you uh, measure the bar distance and the hitch to axle distance and put measurements in there so your mapping is correct. So we'll put the bar distance. It's going to give a warning um, that we're going to ch we're changing a measurement so go ahead and hit proceed and we'll put our bar distance at 200. This is just for an example. You'll want to measure with a tape measure and then we'll put hitch to axle at 180 inches. Once you have the measurements in, we'll want to go to the third tab on the right, application control. And it's currently with the three uh, molecules, it's set up as a granular and we want to switch it to anhydrous. So you'll hit the pencil over here on the right. And where it says granular, we'll want to hit granular. It's also going to give us a warning that we're changing the uh, product so hit proceed and then hit granular again and we'll switch it to anhydrous and we'll hit apply now that we have the implement set up we'll go in and we'll set up our products so we'll hit the silo in the top and then we'll scroll all the way down to where we have it says NH3 section group 1 we see there's no product here, so we'll select product and we'll select add new. And we'll put a product name of NH3. Make sure that the form is anhydrous and then our units is pounds of N per acre. And then we'll need to put a rate one and rate two in. You can push and hold. Put 150 pounds and we'll put 180 pounds and then as you scroll down we'll need to put in a usage and we'll put in fertilizer and then once you have the usage in you'll be able to hit add at the bottom of the page and so I'll add the product into the 1200 and you'll see now we're populated with our rate one at 150, rate two at 180. Next, um, we'll need to put in some push buttons on the uh, your run screen. So find a run screen and we'll, we'll need to add in a, um, a work condition here. So just push and hold the run screen at the bottom so we can go in and edit and we'll hit yes. And then we'll need to take off two of these uh, ones that you don't use. So we'll just trash can the top two. Once you have those trash can, hit the plus sign on the top. You'll come over to implement boom. And we'll want to select the NH3 section group one rate control one by two. 
Once you have that selected, go and hit the X to save. So now this will be the, uh, the buttons that you can push, rate one to rate two. This is where you'll change your rates for your um, anhydrous bar. Um, and that completes the setup of the task controller um, connected to a Raven RCM running an anhydrous bar.